Hey, did you ever get to see Franco compete? Uh, let me think. Did I? Did I? Let me think. Mm. No, actually, I don't think I did. Wow. I don't think. No, I. I, I mm. No, I don't. I, I never actually saw him compete. That's the funny thing. You didn't see the yeah. uh, the seventy six or the eighty one Olympia that he won. No, I didn't see no. that. No. Okay, yeah. I saw, I saw him training in the gym for those contests, and I saw what he looked like, but I didn't actually see him compete. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I wasn't at those contests. I yeah, would have liked to been. When I was going over his biography yesterday, his contest history and stuff, it it was amazing how many shows he won. I mean, I think in in nineteen seventy he won. Um, the Mr. Europe overall for a short guy, that was impressive. And then he won Mr. Universe overall, Mr. International. Then he won Mr. World in 1971. And then he started competing in the Olympia every year after that. I think it was from 72 up, up to 76. He did the yeah. Olympia every year. So, That's a tremendous, I think if I remember correctly, I think he met Arnold at a contest in the, uh, that would have to be in the 60s. 65, where, yeah. Yeah, I think Arnold had won the Junior Europe contest. Right, right. And, and I'm not sure what show that Franco was in or whether he was competing. He might have been competing as, he as a, a power lifter. lifter. Yeah. And, and there's that famous photo of him, of him and Arnold standing together, and Franco's in the power lifting outfit. Right. You know, right. very small, very small back then. You know, yeah. but that's where they met. You know, and and uh, I remember him, uh, Arnold, talk, telling me how uh, how uh, you know he, he used to run a gym in uh, Munich. Uh, and, uh, you know, he just only did his run to the gym. He says, but he, uh, uh, him and, uh, him and Franco would like fool around and they'd run around and the, you know, like, they had a Coca-Cola machine in the middle of the gym. He told me some funny stories, but, but him and Franco trained at that gym in Munich. Bodybuilding Heroes and Legends, Volume 1 by John Hansen is the book that celebrates the golden age of bodybuilding. This was the era in which legends such as Arnold Schwarzenegger, Sergio Oliva, Frank Zane, Robbie Robinson, Cal Skalak, and Mike Menser battled it out on stage for the biggest titles in bodybuilding. Read about some of the most exciting competitions that took place in the 1970s, including the Oliva-Schwarzenegger battles, Zane's first Olympia victory, and Skalak's controversial Mr. Olympia appearance, and much more. Filled with inspiring images of some of the greatest bodybuilders in the history of the sport, Bodybuilding Heroes and Legends Volume 1 is now available on Amazon.com or email John directly at naturalolympia at gmail.com.